She left the fair shores of her own native Ireland. She left them at noon on a grand summer's day. She bid a goodbye to her friends and companions, and she sailed for America so far, far away. Twas little she thought as she stepped on board of that liner that bore her away from the foil's sunny shore. T'was a little she thought as she stepped on that liner that her own beloved Derry she would never see more. She landed on a Sunday in a New York's biggest city. Mid every hurry, bustle and care, she surprise at the New York skyscrapers and she wished she was back in her dairy so fair for four years she worked in a big mill in Boston. The hours were long and no sun did shine there. The roses soon left the fair cheeks of young Ethna. And she pined like a caged bird for her dairy so fair. One night as she slept in her cold attic chamber, she dreamt that her own darling mother was there. But it was the angel of death that had softly come o'er her and took away Athna from this sad world of care. They dug her a grave out at Holy Cross Abbey, where many an exile a grave has found there. A Shamrock they planted above her. Now she sleeps her last sleep far from Derry so fair.